Good evening, guys. This is the Crypto Jarhead. Um, I wasn't going to make a video tonight unless something important happened, something that was, you know, worth making a video on. I'm going to try and keep this short and quick. I am on daddy duty, and uh, it has been... It's been, a, it's been a rough night. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, so, real quick, the Oracle is out. Um, a few other YouTubers... Crypto Yardy, Crypto Plumber, and Noof, from what I've heard. Um, I'm, I refuse to watch their videos, so I, I'm just reporting what I heard there. But regardless, a few YouTubers posted uh, the Oracle's personal address, which would be fine. I mean, not fine. That's still crossing a line. Um, but here's the deal. They got that information from the Oracle's baby mama. And they post that information knowing full well that the Oracle's three-year-old son <coughs> spends a lot of his time there at the address that they posted. Um, and that is unforgivable to me. That is a line that should never, ever have been crossed. Hate the man all you want, go after the man all you want for his actions, call him a scam artist till you're blue in the face, make donut memes all day, you know, um, <laughs> chuckle about the fat psychic, you know, whatever, it's all fair. That's what happens when you expose yourself as a person uh, in, you know, becoming a, a YouTube content creator, you know, you expose yourself to ridicule. And that's something that all of us YouTubers understand and accept. But one thing that should, <laughs> shouldn't even have to be mentioned is that family is off limits. Especially children. Especially fucking toddlers. Shame on you. Um, so... I'm just flabbergasted that people would do this. You know, post that kind of information knowing, knowing that you're putting a, a child at risk. It's just unreal how low some people will stoop. But enough about that. What does that mean for us moving forward? Uh, the Team Us content creators, the people who make videos, uh, Crypto Keeper, Crypto Gems. Uh, Alcoins, if he ever wanders back from Mexico. Um, I hear that they have maps and compasses down there, brother. Uh, no, seriously, um, I heard that he's got the flu, so I hope that he recovers soon, because that's no bueno. Uh, uh, crypto Hunter, Loco for Crypto, uh, you know, all those guys. <clears throat> uh, and I'm sure I'm forgetting a few of you. Uh, it now falls to us to carry the torch, to continue to support the platforms that the pack is currently invested in. You know, so we need to keep our ears open for uh, for updates. You know, things that might affect it. Uh, any new strategies that we can derive from from this news, um, things like that. You know, but it also falls to us. I know the Oracle was talking about not getting into any new projects anytime soon. Um, which I agree with. He didn't. He didn't mean forever, you know. And so if he's not going to be around, you know, it falls to us to keep keep our ears down to the ground, you know, to to sniff out the next opportunity uh, when the timing is right, you know, and present it to the pack so that each individual member can decide for themselves, they can look at the information and choose whether or not this is something that they want to put money into. You know, that's what it's that's what this whole thing is about is making money. The whole thing is not about the Oracle. We all love the Oracle. You know. <clears throat> and I think I can speak for uh, the vast, vast majority of us when we say that we're very sorry to hear what happened to you, brother. Uh, but we support you one hundred percent. You know, take care of your family, take care of your son. You know, do what you got to do. Uh, 
if the time comes where you can come back, we will be here waiting. Uh, you know, welcome you back. And if that time never comes, thank you for the education that you gave us. Uh, you know, this man spent a lot of time trying to educate people uh, on cryptocurrency, not just, you know, promoting platforms and trying to make money, you know, but he did a lot of stuff. A lot of his uh, lesser viewed videos were informational, you know, uh, how to do this, you know, uh, what are the pros and cons of, you know, hardware wallets? He did a video on that, you know, he did a video on all kinds of stuff, you know, that a lot of people may not have known. You know, he did videos on how to trade, uh, you know. Uh, he did technical analysis videos, which most of them were crypto profit <laughs> doing the video. But, you know, uh, the Oracle's got his own take, his own spin, his own way of talking, of doing things. Um, that just makes a lot of sense to a lot of people, you know. So, and I love crypto profits. You know, his <laughs> his analysis is insane. It's great, you know. Um, but... And uh, if you're listening to this, Prophet, <laughs> no, I'm saying this with love. Um, you're pretty fucking dry, bro. Which is one thing that I personally love about you because I can handle that, you know? Um, how a lot of times I'm, when I'm watching YouTube videos, I'm actually driving home. Uh, so I'm not watching the video, I'm just listening to the information out there. And what I love about Crypto Prophets is, is no fluff. Well, no, he started adding fluff at the end of his videos, but the the meat and potatoes of his videos, no fluff, it's just information, and he speaks slowly and clearly. It's great. If you haven't checked out his pro his channel yet, it's Crypto Profits. Love that channel. <clears throat> um, <coughs> shit, sorry, it's been a long day, guys. Um, so, um, I'm not going anywhere. I know that uh, Crypto Keeper's not going anywhere. Crypto Gems ain't going anywhere. Uh, we're still... <clears throat> <clears throat> Damn it. Uh, still need to do roll call. You know, there's a there's a few of us that we haven't heard from yet, but I'm sure that we will. So give it a little time, guys. Um, but regardless, Team Us is not going to go anywhere. Um, I'm sure that there are some people that will... You know, I'm, I'm sure that the team will will shrink a bit now that uh, our our leader is is taking a break, um, which is okay. You know, it's not ideal. It's not what I want, but it's okay. We'll be okay. You know, we'll continue to do what we do, and that is uh, find ways to make money together. You know, so that's really all I've got to say on this subject. Um. <sighs> I just can't believe somebody would threaten a kid. It's that's ridiculous, man. Just why? Like why? You know, and even if you don't think that you directly threaten a kid, let me tell you what you just did. Okay. Let's just say somebody was out there felt like he was scammed in a platform and directly blamed the Oracle. Okay. Let's just say that this person was a little mentally unbalanced. You know. Maybe he became mentally unbalanced by going to Iraq or Afghanistan. Maybe this individual knows how to make explosives. Explosive devices. Give you a hint. They're not hard to make. They're really not. You know. So if such a person existed that wanted to retaliate against the Oracle and had the means to do so via like a bomb or something, something indirect, but didn't know where to find him, well, now he does. You post that information, and you got it from the mom. You got it from the kid's mother. You know? 
it doesn't take two and two to put put it together that his son is going to be at that house. At least sometimes. You know, and uh, I mean, if there was some nut job out here who wanted to send Frank a, a, a damn postage bomb. Who knows if it's going to be him that opens it? Maybe it's his kid. Maybe his kid is sitting right next to him when he opens it. You know. You don't think about this shit. It's disgusting. You know, so. Once again, I want to thank the Oracle for all the time and effort and education that he passed along to us. You know. I've got nothing but respect for this man. Even if he was not right 100% of the time. And even if all the platforms that I follow him into do end up going under before I make a penny off of them. Just the amount of information, the education that I've learned from this man is, was life-changing. And it certainly changed the way I look at things. You know, and so for if nothing else but that, thank you, Oracle. That's all I got, guys. Good night. Happy hunting wolves. Um, <laughs> hopefully I've got good news to bring you guys tomorrow. Um, but uh, yeah, we'll see. <laughs> Today was a bad day. Tomorrow's a new day. Happy hunting wolves. <laughs>